everybody, it's Robin Moses and I am here with Cherry Bomb and we are starting this tutorial with Peacefully Me by Dazzle Dry and Twyla True Car, Car Service, which is a um, neutral brownish purple and when it's on, it almost takes a, it looks dark, oh gosh, like a gray purple, almost black. Anyway. I'm going to do some bright and cheerful flowers on these two. And oh, I'm sorry, let me show you my palette. So let me scroll back. Okay, so I'm going to do the stripes using my striping brush that you can get at RobinMosesNailArt.com and I've mixed purple, black, and a little bit of this neon purple. And what happens is it, it turns it into a color that is of the same in the same family as car service and then I'm going to be using pink and purple and teal and yellow and green and brown and a little gold hopefully maybe not all of them maybe just some of them so let me zoom in and here we go so using my um, striping brush I'm going to top dot right and then you turn the finger and then you dot turn the finger dot, turn, yeah. nylon, yeah. what's it called? The fishnet. Thank you. Okay, <laughs> I forget words when I'm painting. So fishnet. Okay, so that's what you're going to start with. Now, every place that they touch, I'm going to get a dotting tool or a stylus, put it into the dot, into the same color, and where they cross, I'm going to put a dot there. So boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. I'm going to do this to all of them that are painted nude, and I will meet you back. And pull, and pull. Okay, on this one, I'm going to take a little bit of teal and mix it with white, and I'm just going to work with teal and white. Yeah, I need to see your other hand so we can keep it natural. Okay, so with the teal and white together, I'm going to mix. Do you see how this this petal is a little bit whiter than that one? And I'm going to pull some of the teal out and some of them will be a little lighter and some of them will be a little darker. Can I? S okay, I got this. I got this <laughs> cherry bomb. We got this. Okay, so. Proud of you. God, thanks! <laughs> okay, so there's that. And I'm going to put some lavender together with a bright purple and mix it. And then I'm um, going to go here for one. And I'm doing just five petal flowers. And then I'm going to do one right here. And, okay, see how this one's starting to look a little bit um, too lavender? So I'm going to add a little bit of white and just punch it out a little bit. This just brightens it up and makes it stand out a little. and makes it just look a little more 3D when, when I put the top coats on. So I'm going to do the top one like this. You can make them pretty. And then with the same green again, go back in and then just dot leaves in. And the leaves, I want them to be long and linear and pretty. They, they are going to go a little bit translucent when they dry, so you'll still be able to see the lines behind them, but they're still going to show up as, as green enhancements of the nail. So they won't define these nails, they'll just enhance. Then I'm going to take some brown uh, metallic and go into the nail like this and touch the leaves. So it looks like they're on a branch. And the chocolate is going to go perfectly with the background and then mesh. And then, if there's any place that I don't like especially, or I just want to add a little bit of um, 
dimension to, I will go here and then add a few like little sticks and leaves. It can go over the leaf or behind it. Just use it. Use it to take your imperfections and extend them into a more organic look. So when it's done, it looks organic, but it also looks like linear. So that's what I'm going to do. When you're done, it's going to look like this, and I will meet you back. Okay, so I have two millimeter round gold beads. Rob. I got this. There we go. You named him Rob? No, I named me Rob. Come on, Rob. <laughs> oh, Rob. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I guess the bead could be named Rob. It's all his fault, everybody. I have nothing to do with this. <laughs> and we just happen to share a name. Anyways, I'm going to finish that out like that. Okay, so I'm not exactly sure exactly how this light's going to fare, but I'm going to show you what's going down. Okay, so here it is, top coated with a matte top coat, and then I just took a little tiny dab of uh, regular top coat and hit every one of those little gems so that they shine and yet the rest stays matte. So, anyways, these will be in the Spring Playlist, the Diva Playlist, or the Flowers Playlist. They're going to make it to everywhere. So. You can get them here. Uh, you can buy brushes at robinmosesnailart.com here, or you can go to the playlists everywhere, whatever. You know, I'm all linked up. So anyways, I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and you can um, learn tons. Please share, please tell a friend, and please try them and show me. Hashtag Robin Moses Nail Art on Instagram, or um, Nail Art Sisterhood, or Sisterhood of Nail Art. I'll see you back with more. Bye! You want to say bye? Bye, Cherry Bomb. Oh, bye. <laughs> <laughs> She's waving at me. Okay, bye. <laughs> I mean, nodding. She's not waving because her hands are here. <laughs> bye. <laughs>